Okay, so the second concept, the second idea we're going to talk about today is using the Dub Desktop app to capture audio and video from another video on your screen. So in this case, we're just going to check out the Dub mobile app one. tutorial. Now, let's say I wanted to capture a part or all of this video. Maybe I want to be a part of it. Maybe I want to react to this video in the same recording. So this is how this is going to work. I'm first going to use the desktop app, record screen. And now once I'm here, I can turn my webcam, move it where I want. I can be over here, over there, wherever I need. I can be whatever size and shape that I want. You can change, change the shape there. And then the important part of this, guys, is the audio. Because when you're wanting to record a YouTube video, very often you want to include the audio from it. Or maybe it's not, it's any video from any place. So right here next to this record button is a drop down, and it says include system audio. So what this is going to do is it's going to include the audio coming from the computer, meaning whatever's playing in the video is going to be included. Now there's another option there that's system audio only. This one include means it's still going to capture my audio. So if I'm speaking, it's still capturing my audio as well as the audio coming from the video. Now, if I want only the system's audio, the, the video's audio, then I'm going to include system audio only, and my microphone will no longer be available because we don't want my microphone interfering with the video. So this is how you'd be able to capture both of those things at once, whether it's you and the video at the same time or just you. So, and you could also do this in clips. So let's say in this first clip, I want it to be both of us. So I'm going to include system audio, press record, three, two, one, and say, guys, I want to show you this video really quick. It's interesting. Check it out. An app to record and share dynamic videos. Manage your CRM. So now I just captured my audio as well as the audio from the video. There's clip one. But now in clip two, I just want to capture the system audio only. I don't want to hear my voice anymore. So I'm going to switch it to audio only, press record. And then now it's going to capture artificial intelligence only the audio from place. my computer Look and no not further. my microphone. The dub so this is how you guys would be able to do this to capture video content of other things. Now, if you're taking something proprietary or with something, guys, you need to cite your sources, right? Don't try to steal somebody else's proprietary training material and then brand it as your own. It's, that's common sense. But yeah, don't steal other people's stuff and claim it as your own. Reacting to other people's stuff, everybody does that, that's fine. But don't steal it as your own. Um, now, another piece of this, guys, is, is the custom size. So let's say when you wanted to record there, but you didn't want to capture all the other stuff in YouTube, then you would use the custom frame there to record just the part of the video that you actually want to capture. So whether that's, you know, including stuff or not including pieces, this is how you're going to capture video with or without audio coming from the computer. All right, let me pause that one.